Hi there, this is the installation tutorial video for the Omega theme. I'm going to show you how to turn this default WordPress installation into this, which is the Omega demo site. So first of all, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to download Omega from Theme Forest and you'll get a zip file something like this. So first thing to do will be to unzip this file and inside you get a folder. If we open that folder you can see there's a folder here called documentation which has got all the docs for the theme. It's also available online if you need it. And there's also the licensing folder. There's a zip file here called Omega Child Theme which is the the child theme if you want to do any major customization of the theme. There's the Omega zip, which is the actual theme file itself, which is what we're going to install into WordPress in a moment. And the PSD folder, which contains the PSD for the theme. And an SVG icons folder, which has all the icons that we've created and used in the theme. So let's get on and make this uh, installation of Omega now. So we're going to install this zip file. So first of all, we go back to the blank WordPress installation that we had. And I'm going to log in. So once you're into the admin panel, you go to Appearance, uh, Themes, and then we're going to click the Add New button at the top, upload a theme, and now we're going to choose that file Omega Zip that we've just uh, unzipped and we click the install now button once that's installed you can activate the theme so there's the theme installed in WordPress and what we're going to do is we're going to go to this Omega menu and click the demo content setup now you can check uh, to make sure that you have all the correct uh, variables. If you see any red variables here, that means you probably need to check the docs and make sure that your server config is, is set up to work with the one-click installer. And then uh, this is the one-click installer where you can select which packages you're going to install. But there are a few dependencies here that we need to install. There's a few plugins that we need to install before we can get this one-click installer to work. So that's really easy to do. All we need to do is go to Appearance, Install Plugins. And these are all the plugins that come bundled with the theme. So I'm just going to go and install them all. OK, so that's installed. And now what we're going to do is we're going to activate all those plugins. So we click this, click activate and apply. OK, so that's all the required plugins installed. And now we can go back to Omega Demo Content Setup. And there's two main choices that you can choose. There's install the main demo content, which is the demo content that you can see uh, here in Home, Pages, Elements, Portfolio, Blog and Contact Pages. And there's also a separate package that you can install, which is just for uh, WooCommerce if you want the shop pages uh, demo content to be installed. You can choose one of each or each or both. I'm just going to install both just to show you. So you just click that button and it asks, asks if, you're, if you're sure. Off we go. Now this uh, might take a, a little while to install because it's actually downloading all the images and content from uh, our servers and installing it into your WordPress uh, theme. So you, you can just watch this progress bar here or you can click the details and you can see each individual image is being installed one by one here. Once this is finished 
it'll start installing the WooCommerce shop content. So I'm just going to leave that going for a while. Okay, so as you can see, it's nearly finished now. Just going to install the last uh, parts of the WooCommerce shop content. And once that's done, you'll see this page, which tells you that it's all been installed. And you can click this blue button that will take you to your demo site. And there it is. All the demo content's been installed. All the images. And all the posts. You will notice at the top some of the uh, fonts might look a little bit different to the demo website and this is really easy to fix. We just need to install the default theme fonts. So I'll show you how to do that quickly. If you just go back into the admin panel you can then go to Omega fonts and the default fonts use Google, so we're going to update our Google fonts. Once you've updated that list, you can go to typography. And you can click this button here at the bottom, install default theme fonts. And that will install uh, Source Sans Pro as the default font for the uh, website. And now if you go back, you can see the default fonts have been installed, so it looks just like the demo website. And you've got all the pages exactly the same as the demo website. portfolio pages. So you're now free to go and edit these to match whatever content you need for your site. Or if you're running a WooCommerce shop, you've got the shop pages set. And it's even installed some demo uh, products for you. And it's set a default image size for your products. And that's it, that's how to install the demo content.